Sean Rooney with us here on the John Madola Show. We're talking long distance running. How'd you get involved with it? Yeah, I want to go run three miles today. <laughs> well, actually, um, my freshman year, they canceled all contact sports. I used to do soccer. And then I came out across country because that was the only sport they were doing. So then I just picked it up and then I, I mean, it was like a love-hate relationship, but I ended up sticking with it over soccer. And yeah, I stayed with it till junior year. Let's talk about Coach Pacetti and, and one of your teammates said, hey, he likes to make it fun for us because it's kind of could be uninteresting at times, but you get to challenge yourself, you get to set some goals, different things, but talk about your connection with him. Yeah, he does a good job making it fun. He, uh, he is a really good motivator before races as well. And we also have Coach Haynes, who's like, he's a really good athlete and he ru does long distance running, so kind of shows us that we can, he shows us what's possible as a runner. Always oh, nice when he's the like a mentor, yeah. When the ladies are doing well and the guys are doing well, but then you get a young coach maybe running with you guys, yeah. pushing you a little bit, that's always cool. But talk about that bond you guys have, and usually this happens with a cross country team, is you guys become a close knit group. You're rooting for the girls, the girls are rooting for the guys. Yeah, we're a really big school, so like, we are close, and it's definitely, since we're a big school, it definitely helps like push each other, and then because we're we're super competitive in practices, we kind of like uh, bond together over that. Like, yeah. Let's talk about the running shoe of choice. Have you kind of, you know, floated around between this brand and that brand? What's your go-to? Well, Nike has been what I've been running in since sophomore year. I really like it. I used to do Brooks, and then I kind of got Nikes, and now I just have Nike trainers and Nike spikes. I really do like Nike, yeah. As far as, you know, some of the longest runs you've ever done, talk about, like, just going out, and, like, one day, whether it was the summer, or, you know, coach said, hey, go try this, or, or talk about some challenging, maybe you went up some mountains. What was, what has been the, the most grueling run you've ever tried? Ooh, the most grueling was probably a 5K I did at Montage Mountain, where we ran up, it's just up the mountain for two miles and then one mile down. Then the longest run was probably in the summer, I think I did 11 miles this summer. I got up to. How about keeping that body healthy? You know, are you at the point here late in the season where you're a little dinged up or you're at a point where coach knows when to push and pull, you're in a good place? Well, I'm definitely in a good place. I make sure to get lots of sleep and uh, I just make sure I'm eating well and drinking lots of water. What are you looking forward to over the next couple of weeks? Well, I'm just getting ready for districts. I'm really excited and hoping to run really well. Hey, great to hear your story. We wish you the best. Thank you.